Hello everybody, my name is Caroline and I am the Cigar Angel. Today I'm going to be smoking the Alec Bradley Raices Cubanas 1941. The wrapper is Honduran, the binder is Nicaraguan, and the filler is Honduran and Nicaraguan. So I'm going to be smoking the Robusto size today and I'm going to be using a V cut and swishing up on all of you today. I usually do the guillotine cut, but I also like the V cut. So cutting is totally preference. There's no right way to cut a cigar. You can even bite it off if you want to. It's, I don't usually like to do that, but anyway. Um, so a little about the Alec Bradley brand before I go ahead and smoke this. Um, Alec Bradley was, um, came about in 1996 by the founder, Alan Rubin, and which surprisingly, the founder isn't Alec Bradley. Alec Bradley happens to be the names of both of Alan Rubin's kids, Alec and Bradley, so that's where the brand name comes from. Um, another thing is... Raices Cubanas is actually the factory which um, pretty much was known to make lots of cigar hit makers. So along with multiple brands, Alec Bradley was one of the ones they would create all these cigars in. So what they did was they actually invited Alec Bradley to be a part of making the, the blend that goes into the Raices Cubanas. So they had just as much of a part in making this as Raices Cubanas. So I'm, uh, it's just a little, little history for you there. Um, so I'm going to smoke this and let you guys know what I think. So I'm back. Been uh, smoking the Raices Cubanas for a little bit and I have to say it's a really great cigar so far um, personally I don't think it's too strong it does have a good amount of pepper to it you know the first couple puffs really give you a good amount of um, white pepper and it definitely hangs out like on your tongue so um, but the thing with that though is peppers there but it's actually really smooth which is interesting because it's really hard to you know find a peppery kind of spicy cigar and also be like smooth and a little creamy at the same time um, you know there's a little bit of you know when you when you retro hail it burns a little bit because of the pepper, but you know, it's not like, it's not killing you when it's going through your nose. Um, about like, a little ways in, it, it doesn't become so peppery. Um, it's just, you know, that initial when you light it up in the first inch is, you get just a blast of pepper. But this is actually a very, um, enjoyable cigar. It's not super full-bodied. Um, it's not considered a full-bodied cigar, but it's more of like a, I guess you could get away with smoking this maybe in the morning, at breakfast, with coffee, but I guess it, it de definitely depends on uh, your taste preference. But I'm going to keep smoking this for a little bit and let you guys know my final thoughts. So I'm getting to the final third of the Raices Cubanas, and I have to say this has turned into a really, really nice medium-bodied cigar. Um, for somebody that's not a really big fan of like spicy pepper kind of cigars, I really enjoyed. This has the perfect blend of pepper and creamy uh, smoothness to it, which makes for a really, really nice cigar. Um, one thing though it um, to take note of is 
not to smoke this too fast towards the end because it'll heat up too quickly and then it'll take away from the smooth clean finish and make it turn like a little bit harsh on your palate so you might not want to try to smoke that too fast um, as I've been smoking it though I've actually gotten hints of like a buttered toffee kind of flavor which was like really awesome I like who doesn't love that flavor so to come across something like that is just just makes it really really nice when you when you taste it so if I were to rate this cigar I would give it an eight and a half out of ten this is one to definitely try from Alec Bradley Alec Bradley has a really solid foundation of really great cigars so as this being one of the newer ones it's definitely one you should pick up in the humidor so um, if you guys have any suggestions or comments please leave them below please subscribe to the Cigar Cigars YouTube channel and Facebook page and right after this video you'll see all seven locations so make sure to stop into the Cigar Cigars locations if they're nearby um, and again I say this every time but if there are cigars that you would like to see reviewed please leave them below and I'd be happy to give you my review on them so until next time I'll see you guys later Today I'm going to be reviewing the Raices. The wrapper is Honduran. The wrapper is Honduran. The binder is Nicaraguan. Wrapper is Honduran. The binder, ugh, Raices Cubanas.